I just want to take a few seconds to share this moment with you guys on being voted as your knockout of the year. This one is true and dear to my heart because coming into Impact, I was trying to find my new home, trying to find my path, starting over, new division and Gosh, what a journey it's been. You guys have been there with me the entire way. I couldn't ask for a better place to be, to grow into the star that I saw myself being and that you guys wanted me to be. What a hell of a division to be a part of. And just, I'm I'm, I'm ecstatic and kind of overjoyed to make history yet once again with Impact Wrestling. So this right here is the cherry on top. And I couldn't think of a better way to end 2023 as your knockout of the year. Woo! <laughs> Since its inception in 2007, the Impact Knockouts World Championship has been the most consistent women's world title in all of professional wrestling, representing opportunity, progress, and respect for its competitors for 16 years. It's Trinity and Perrazzo for the championship tonight at Slammiversary. That tradition continues here in two pairs of very good hands. I, I hate the cliche big match feel, if I'm being honest, but hot damn, does this one have a big match feel? This is Trinity's first match for a singles title in roughly a year and a half. So from facing a queen to now squaring off with the virtuosa, this is an environment that Trinity thrives in. But again, this is still a new environment for Trinity. That's right. At the end of the day, she's still you know, setting her feet down here in Impact Wrestling. It's been a few months. She's done incredible things. But this is a new mountaintop. This is a new hill to climb. She needs to rise to the moment as she's done all along. Certainly a feeling out process here early on. I talked about it. Both women have fantastic submission finishers for Trinity. Starstruck has paid dividends for it. It's why she's unbeaten. On the flip side, Deanna Perrazzo, she's never tapped out here in Impact Wrestling. In fact, she's made a habit of tapping out other people. I'd say she's most gifted submission artist in Impact today. Uh, that's absolutely no doubt. One of the most gifted submission artists in all of the world. Hold on, shoulders down, shoulders down there, Perrazzo. Oh, oh Perrazzo, oh, gotta be careful there. Now on top of Trinity. And there it is. Right for the Fujiwara arm bar, and Trinity rolled away. The master of that Fujiwara arm bar came that close to snapping the arm and breaking the dreams of Trinity. And to me, that's the key difference. Trinity's starstruck oh. is an incredible move if she can lock it in. But Deanna Perrazzo can lock you in from any position. A submission artist oh. in the purest sense of the word. Went for the rear view. And there you go, too. The wise nature of the virtuosa knows when to take a beat. What? The veteran instincts kicking in. Perrazzo taking her time. Title can only change hands via pinfall or submission inside the ring. And Trinity goes after Perrazzo accordingly. You can feel the eagerness of Trinity oozing off oh! her. Oh, my God. Already willing to take risks here in this championship matchup. I look at this. Some of the athletic ability of Trinity. That's made her a champion in the past. Now sending Perrazzo back inside. Trinity's going up top. And that, to me, that's going to be the story of this matchup. Whoa! Oh, cross body. Both these wrestlers, so incredible performers. Oh! But I think it's going to be the pragmatism of Perrazzo versus the enthusiasm of Trinity. Trinity wanted to quicken the pace, trying to use the environment of the ring to her advantage. We know that's not necessarily what Perrazzo wants to do, but the Virtuosa can keep up with that. Just like Trinity, known for her athleticism, has now added submission to her game. Perrazzo, who's known for submission submissions, has been known to add a little bit of that athletic, almost lucha libre-like style to her game at times as well. A look at the left arm pin back. Oh, and a stop to the left arm. But that right there is the MO of the Virtuosa that I know and love, and you all do too.
And now Perrazzo has targeted a body part. And this is a dangerous situation. We're just minutes in for this knockout world title fight. There's a cover after the shots on the arm and a kick out by Trinity. And when the Virtuosa gets focused on that arm, it is a dangerous place to be for her opponent. And even just going for that cover there, Perrazzo making Trinity work, making her kick out with that now injured arm. Which only adds more stress, more pain, more pressure to the injury. Ooh, 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 trying to get Perrazzo up on her shoulders here, but the oh. arm gave out, and then the arm ringer. And as this arm here, Tom, as this arm gets more and more hurt of Trinity, she's gonna have to start fighting instinct as a wrestler to do certain moves, do certain maneuvers because there's so many things that require both your arms. Can Trinity adapt oh. to that? Able to roll through and continues to snap the arm of Trinity. This is a great plan for Deanna Perrazzo Suplex. here. Suplex, here's the cover to hold on to the title. Two count and a kick out there. You could see Trinity kicked out, got the shoulder up rather with the right arm instead of the left. There's a little bit of that adaptation. That's good. She's going to need to keep mm. doing that constantly in this matchup as the Virtuosa bears down on that elbow, on that shoulder, on that wrist. Oh, now Trinity. A little take Perrazzo off her feet there. Quick shot to the leg. Did enough. Second in breathing room there. Oh! Went for the leg drop. Oh, and a low basement drop kick by Perrazzo. There's a cover, again to hold on to the title, and look at Trinity wincing in pain. And I think that low drop kick too was also, rather than focused on the, the chest or the face, was aimed right at that left arm once again. Perrazzo's just taking her time, here's the cover. Here's the cover and a kick out. She was able to strike early. Now it's slow and steady. One track mind for the Virtuosa. Break it down. Oh. It's now oh. getting a little bit more of that physicality and these chops from Deanna Barrazzo. Whipped hard into the corner. Trinity felt that one. It went down hard. And Barrazzo. All the way through your spine, and you feel that one. In your soul, as Perrazzo lets you know how she feels. Hold on. Trinity was trying to trap Perrazzo there in the corner. And the Virtuoso, oh, dumping Trinity center of the ring. Just like that. Oh, oh, look at this. Look at Trinity tied up here by Perrazzo. Perrazzo looking to bend Trinity in half here. A brief departure from the arm. It doesn't hurt to just twist the spine a little bit as well. I'm doing some damage to the legs, to the base of Trinity. Very smart, on out Trinity. Shoulders Whoa. down, shoulders down, and a kick out by Perrazzo. Oh, and a clothesline by the Virtuosa. Hashtag Slammiversary now trending number five in the United States. We want to thank you for tuning in worldwide as well on pay-per-view, fight TV, and DAZN internationally. Slammiversary been trending all night long, continuing to rise. And it's moments like these, matches like these, competitors like Trinity and Perrazzo driving that focus. Oh, and a kick to the face there by Trinity and a small glimmer of opportunity. But you see there, even with that space still shaking at the arm, so trying to recover. Now using her right arm here to turn things around on Perrazzo. Now the good arm at this point in the matchup. Oh, and a big right. Now Perrazzo charges after Trinity, up on the shoulders and a Samoan drop. And Trinity fired up here, found a moment, an opening here to turn things around. Oh, what a kick to the face. Is it Trinity's time? Oh, what a kick out by Perrazzo. Oh, and the rolls into a cover. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, starstruck. Stop, wait a minute, shoulders down. Perrazzo had an answer. Perrazzo stacking up Trinity, another cover. Now Trinity's turn, shoulders down and a kick out. That was a great counter there oh. from Perrazzo. And then both these wrestlers going back and forth. This one's starting to pick up a little bit of steam. Oh, I was going for the head scissor takedown. Oh, look at the strength of Perrazzo. 
Look out. Oh! That's got to be! The pile driver can't get out by Trinity! Perrazzo looks like she might have caught a little bit one of these kicks from Trinity, but here able to absolutely plant Trinity. Yet somehow the challenger stays in this matchup. Oh, wait, wait a minute, is it time for the Queen's Gambit? Is Parasso gonna end it right here? Looking to put it away. Trinity fights it though. Went for the kick, Trinity, oh, off the ropes, doubled over by Perrazzo. Oh, the knee lift. Side rushing leg sweep, you know what comes next, look out. get it in, there it is! The Fujiwara armbar locked back in. And after all that work to the arm has been done, how much can Trinity stand? Trinity close to the ropes, trying to get her good arm, the right arm to the bottom row. Oh, he finally gets there before Perrazzo could pull back and if she did, she could maybe hook in that Venus de Milo. And if you ask me, it 100% would have been over there. The first signs of frustration gracing the face of the virtuosa. Oh! Two who've watched each other from afar, learning each other up close. Oh! oh! Face first into the canvas! Incredible athleticism from the challenger here. The split leg and moonsault to the back. Rolls over Perrazzo. Cover. No, oh, and a kick out by the Virtuosa. Oh, face first into the mat with Perrazzo. Trinity trying to get back in this thing and immediately followed it up with this beautiful split leg and moonsault. But the Virtuosa stays alive. The back and forth contest really picking up steam. And now Trinity has got a chance here against Perrazzo. Perrazzo out to the apron. Oh, she sets Perrazzo up. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, and Perrazzo did her homework. Has seen Trinity pull that off here in Impact many times. Oh. Now, both wrestlers out on no man's land there. The apron, oh wait. You gotta be kidding me. Oh, no. Queen's Gambit on the hardest part of the ring. Good God, Trinity, Trinity is out, Tom. And look at the urgency here from Perrazzo. Here's the cover, hook to the leg. It's a no, and Trinity kicked out. Trinity kicked out. What? You have got to be kidding me. Perrazzo is shocked that this right here Boom. did not end things. The Queen's Gambit on the apron, but somehow, some way, Trinity stays alive. Maybe those precious seconds between the apron and the center of the ring go for the cover, save Trinity. Just enough time to get a shoulder up at the last second. And now Perrazzo, you can really feel the frustration. Trinity got to the ropes in the Fujiwara armbar. She somehow kicked out of Queen's Gambit. She keeps on coming. That is the resilience of the athlete we know in Trinity. What's Perrazzo got in mind? Oh, not oh, this. God. Jordan Grace is back That's this. right. This is what happened at Rebellion. And Trinity knows it too. Oh. Desperately fighting it off. Oh, now Trinity. Wait, wait, wait. Oh, my God. Oh! Down go Perrazzo and Trinity. And now Trinity trying to turn this over. That oh, shoulder's wait, 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 out wait. for a moment. Oh, now Starstruck. Oh! Starstruck. Got it locked in here. Can the Virtuoso withstand it? Reaching for the ropes here. And look at this. Look at Trinity trying to tie up the line.
against one of the greatest champions of all time. Coming to Windsor to prove that betting on yourself pays off.